Hey, uh, my name is Matwana Wabantu, or you can call me Hamish. Before we get started, I do please uh, go to my Instagram page, to our Instagram page, okay? The Instagram of a family, our Instagram, Matwana underscore Wabantu. The reason why is very important for you, you have to do it. So, you see what we do, uh, giving back, we have a giving back program, feeding, because they say always, never forget where you come from, okay? So, I do believe what goes around comes around so giving back and giving when they say giving back means it could be knowledge it could be time it could be food it could be a uh, skill so helping other people send up their own to fees and be able to move by themselves okay now uh, let's get started without further ado if you face time make sure you leave a comment or so even you're always here leave a comment is very very important so I know uh, my familia here now, so we're going to do two questions right here, okay? We're going to do this question right here and this question here. So stay here. I'll do them very quick, okay? So we have the question. They say solve for ball of P. So now I'm going to do face and foremost. I'm going to find the common denominator. I'm going to start on the left-hand side. Look. So I'm going to cross or multiply this way. And then this also I'm going to multiply that way. So I have my negative in the middle. Negative and I'll say five times negative. It's going to be negative five. Bracket. 3p minus 1 and then you come that side 3 times 2 equal to 6 3 times 2 equal to 6 bracket and then you have a p minus 8 so and then you multiply these two now 5 times 3 equal to 15 so greater or equal you do the same thing on it right hand side now you say 1 times everything 1 times anything that's something so p plus 8 now we say 5 times 3, negative 15. And then you over, you multiply these two. 5 times 1 equal to 15. No, no, 5 times 1 equal to 5, my Paul. 5 times 1 equal to 5. So now if you can look careful now, the denominator is now the same. So let me try to make this denominator the same. I mean, it's on the left-hand side because this is left-hand side, this side, and right-hand side is this way. So let me find, let me try to make the denominator the same. How am I going to make the same? This is 5, this is 15. Means I'll multiply is by 3 but whatever to make it 15 but when you whatever you're going to do at the bottom do the same thing to the top so i'm going to multiply also this by by 3 so now this is going to be 5 times 3 equal to 15 so i can simply say 15 let me say this space i'll say this is going to become 15 now so since the denominator are the same i can cancel them so on top i'm left with negative 5 times 3 look negative 5 times 3 multiply negative 5 from, times 3 15 p negative 5 times negative Positive minus minus six times three equal to six p, and then negative six times negative eight positive forty. Eight. Now we go to the right hand side, which says greater or equal, like how they gave us here. Now you go p. Now this could be p. Eight minus fifteen equal to negative seven. But remember, you have to multiply by three. Now three times p is going to be three p. Three times seven negative twenty one. So it's going to be three p negative twenty one. So I can write next line, 3p and negative 21. 3p, that's true. So I can group the like term together. What is a like term? Things with a p, things with a p, they're like terms. So let's put them together. Negative 15 minus 6p equal to minus 21p plus 5 plus, because this plus 5 plus 4, 8 equal to 53 plus 53. Greater or equal... 3p minus 21. Now, let's take all the like term on one side. Look, 3p negative 21p. So, I'll take this to the left. But remember, this is positive. When there's no sign, means something's positive. And the sign always on the left. So, when you jump over this inequality sign, it's positive. It's going to become negative. So, here we have it. So, we have what? Negative 21p. Let me use black here. Negative 21p. And when this comes, it's going to be minus 1. 3p. Greater or equal, here we have a negative 21 because it's a number, and this number must go over. So this is plus when it go, because plus on the left. When it comes, it's gonna be 50. Let's put together. So this is gonna be negative 24p, greater or equal, and this is gonna be negative 7. If you put them together, it's gonna be negative 74. So if you want to get the value of p here, way easy. I'm gonna say for me to get the value of p, ash must divide by negative 24 divide by negative 24 and divide by negative 24 look here is very very important now this and this cancel but 
because we divide it by negative only if you divide only i said again only if you divide by negative <clears throat> this is going to change the direction it's going to be like this so p is less or equal negative 74 divided by <clears throat> divided by 24 negative 74 divided by 24 so negative 24, 74 divided by 24 i can say negative and negative positive but like i say the direction is changing because you divide by negative so by 2 it's going to be 37 if you divide by 2 it's going to be 12 so it's going to be 37 over 12 so i can simply say here p less or equal to uh, 37 over 12 and if you can look careful here it's going to be option number three now let me explain something very very important about divide by negative inequality this is very very important Inequality. If somebody give, let's say, uh, 4x is, uh, let's say, less than 16, or any number that doesn't matter, or 20. If you divide by 4, you divide by 4. Let's just see what I see. Just a second, right? I'm trying to wait to make a space. So we say we divide by 4. We divide by 4 means this and this cancel, so x is still going to be on the same duration, the inequality. You know why? Because you did not divide by negative number. But if you divide by negative number, is another story. The duration of the inequality must change. Example, let's take the same question. Somebody say, uh, let's say in number, say negative 3k, and they say uh, greater than 18. So for me to get k means I'm going to divide by negative 3 by negative 3. This in this concept, so it's going to be k. The direction of inequality must change, so it's going to be like that way. And this is going to be 18 divided by negative 3, negative 6. The reason, because you divide by negative. Only when you divide by negative, excuse me. So our option is going to be option number 2. Now let's go to the next question. So for the next question here, where are you? So for the next question, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, uh, the game is the same. So I'm going to say this is over 1 and let's put this over 1. Common denominator. So we can cross, cross that way and this cross that way. Now 1 times 2a plus 1 is going to be 1 bracket 2a plus 7 minus minus. And now you multiply that way. 3 times 5, 15. And then you over, you multiply this 2. 3 times 1 equal to 3. Great. Now you come to the right hand side, you cross as well. 8 times 5, 5a, minus minus 1 times 2, equal to 2. Over 1 times 5, equal to 5. So now, the denominator are not the same. This is 5, this is 3. How are you going to make them the same? Means we know the common number is 15. Between 5 and is 15. So I'm going to multiply. Look here. What I'm, doing. I'm going to multiply by 3 to make 15. But whatever you're going to do at the bottom, you must do the same thing to the top. And how are you going to make this 3, 15? Means I must multiply this by 5. But what you're going to do at the bottom, you must do the same thing to the top. So we're going to put it here, 5. So this is going to be 5 times 3, 15, 5 times 3, 15. So this is going to be 15 now. And this one also is going to be 15 now. And like I said on the previous question, since these are the same means this and this can cancel, so we're left with that. So I'm going to say 5 in, let's simplify. 2a plus 7 minus 15, so it's going to be 2a. Plus 7 minus 15 equal to negative 80 bracket greater than we're inequality now. 3 times 5, 15a. 3 times uh, 2, negative 6. Now, 5 times 2 equal to 10a. 5 times, it's going to be negative 40. Greater or equal, now this is going to be 15a minus 6. Let's group all the like terms. What are the like terms? The like terms are 10a and 15a. So this is going to go to the left. So we have a 10a here. When this go to the left, it's going to become minus. Greater, greater. Now we have a negative 6 on the right. This negative is going to come here. It's going to become positive because it's negative 40. It's going to become positive 40 because it jumped the inequality sign. So uh, 10 minus 5 is going to be equal to negative 5a, uh, greater or equal. Now negative 6 plus 34 plus 4 equal to 34. So I'm going to get the value of a here. To get the value of a means I must divide by negative 5 through out negative 5 this is 34 so 
negative 5 through L. So divide by negative 5, divided by negative 5. This is this concept, but the direction of inequality must change. It's like this, right? So now it's going to become, excuse me, sorry, A, it must change because you divide by negative. Uh, 34, negative 34 over 5. Now, what is negative 34 over 35? Here, if you look carefully, there is no that option. So we must change to mix the fraction. Now we go to grade 4. Mix the fraction. Fourth grade. Fourth grade. Mix the fraction. Now you say A. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. It's coming. So if you can look, okay. How many 5 in 30? There are 6. And then, which is 30? And then we left with 4 over 5. Which is going to be the option number? 1. See? So it's going to be option number 1. Because how many 5 in 30? Equal to less than negative 34 over 5. Less than negative 34 over 5. Now we say, no. How many 5 in 30? We know there are 6. So we're going to say A. Less than how many 5 in 30? 6. But don't forget your negative. 6 which is 30. And they'll be left with 4 over 5. Which is going to be option number 1. Less than. See what I'm saying? And sometimes they do purpose just to confuse. See, this is the confusion. It's not true. You see? It's not true. So our answer is going to be option number one. So for that being said, uh, share it with a lot of people. And I'm going to see you soon. Peace and um, love. Peace and love. Peace and love. Did you practice math today? Don't forget to practice, huh? Huh? Huh?